значит, у нас минимум пятеро, да, Владимир Сергеевич? Двое детей, двое детей загинувших. Один травмований, да. Не, 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 загинувший. З той сторони також один загинувший, як мінімум. Тут, значит, у нас минимум пятеро, да, Влад Сергеевич? Я була вдома, не все, а поряд просто лежали трупи. Тут був салон краси, там згорів чоловік в машині. Путін ордерів, щоб зробити нові нуклеарні міссили і зробити, зробити їх на НАТО країнах. Росія може розуміти продукцію та глобальну дипломацію ground-based intermediate and short-range missiles, як президент Владимир Путін сказав. Мунішенів цього типу були originally restricted by the Intermediate Range Nuclear Forces Treaty, which collapsed back in 2019, yet Russia opted neither to produce nor deploy such weaponry even after the demise of the Cornerstone Agreement with the US. During the Cold War, such missiles were a key part of the Soviet force, but in the early 1990s, the United States removed from Europe all of its intermediate range ground-based nuclear cruise missiles and ballistic missiles and the Soviets eliminated their SS-20 missiles. These moves were considered major steps in reducing tensions, but a decade ago Putin reversed Russia's move deploying Iskander missiles to Kaliningrad, the Russian region closest to Western European cities. Vladimir Putin made the remarks during a meeting with permanent members of the country's Security Council. Hostile actions by the US now require Moscow to review its stance on the Intermediate Range Nuclear Forces Treaty covered weaponry, Putin told the gathering. Moscow has lived by its promise to neither produce these missiles nor deploy them as long as the United States does not deploy such systems anywhere around the globe following the collapse of the treaty, Putin noted. However, the situation has changed, with Washington deploying such missiles overseas, the president said. We now know that the US is not only producing these missile systems, but has also brought them to Europe, Denmark, to use in exercises. Not long ago, it was reported that they were in the Philippines. It is unclear whether they have taken these missiles out of the Philippines or not, Putin explained. Russia now needs to respond to this and decide on our further steps in this regard, Putin stressed, suggesting the resumption of intermediate and short-range missiles was actually the only option for the country. It appears that we need to begin producing these attack systems and then, based on the actual situation, decide on where to deploy them to ensure our security if necessary, he said.